Hi, Casey with Countryside here. And the reason I'm holding this bag of fertilizer that says plant tone on it is I want you to remember that when you go out in your yard and look at your boxwoods. Because you're used to your boxwoods being a beautiful, beautiful green. And this year we have what is known as winter burn. And what the winter burn has done, it has basically sucked the moisture out of those leaves. And it's made your whole top of your boxwood be this lovely golden color that you don't like. But what we want you to do is fertilize with the plant tone. It's a nice granule, you can mark it in the soil right around at the base of the plant. And then wait until the new growth comes in and then go ahead and trim it. Because if you get excited and trim right away, you're going to be cutting off a lot of those new buds that are still there that could still come out with new, the new growth. So that's kind of what we're, we're looking at. Unfortunately, there's also another problem that is happening with boxwood. And that is what's known as boxwood blight. It somewhat looks similar to the boxwood winter burn. But the main way you can tell the difference is if you look at the, ne at the, at the needles, what am I saying, they're leaves, um, <laughs> sorry. At the leaves, you will see a little like dark brown speck. And it normally happens, boxwood's leaves are, are fairly small, and it normally happens down at kind of at the very base of it where you're gonna see that little dark brown speck. And that is the boxwood blight. Unfortunately, there is no cure for that. If you see that, that plant should be removed. If you're in doubt which it is, bring us a small sample, let us look at it, and we can advise you which one it is and what you should do. Thanks for coming to see us when you come and see us this spring. Hopefully it won't be snowing or raining on the day that you do, but we look forward to seeing you. Bye.